So then once you do that, you should be seeing much more rewards every single day. Any other questions? Yes. What do you think about Kubo? We're going to talk about Kubo, but not on stream today. What else? Um, yeah, can you talk about Kubo? Okay, we'll talk about Kubo, I promise. We'll get there. I want to talk about Helium and Block Create. I want to hear about Kubo! Fine, we'll talk about Kubo! Nerdy Dude Stuff For those of you keeping track at home, today's Beer of the Day is brought to you by Ivanhoe Park Brewing Company, brewed in Orlando, Florida. This is called Joyland American IPA, sitting at 7% alcohol by volume. This is named after a historic park located near Ivanhoe Park. As you can tell, Joyland. This is an American IPA, has a very light taste, light body, but it is full of hopsy, bitter, piney flavors. You get a lot of piney aromatics on the exhale after your sip. This is a very solid beer brewed not too far from me, and I enjoy it. 3.75 out of 5. Cheers to you guys. Bink! What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another video about Bitcoin, passive income, all that good stuff. If this is your first time on the channel, please take a moment to consider subscribing, turning on that bell notification, and liking this video. That way it can help the algorithm, and we can get to 25,000 subscribers. Cheers to each and every one of you guys that are here with us today. Now, here on the channel... We like to provide some entertainment. We like to provide you with our daily journey in the crypto space, whether it be plug-and-play miners, which this little bad boy is probably going to be letting us down in the near future. We might be stopping content on Planet Watch just because of the way they are treating us aware element owners uh, and other devices. But we also want to fill in the gaps on some opportunities for passive income when something like this is about to go put potentially stay tuned for another video on that so with that said we were live streaming yesterday and quite a few individuals did ask us about kubo then we were on discord with our buddy crypto wealth and mind of tron and crypto wealth mentioned kubo and then mind of tron talked to me about kubo so i hear everyone loud and clear kubo is going to be the new hotness is it going to be hotness for quick or long term crypto wealth and he'll probably do a video soon i'm looking at his channel right now and i don't see congratulations to you for hitting thirty thousand subscribers by the way what a great feat but anyway crypto wealth was talking about kubo and he did some digging and in information that he passed on to me that this is going to be potentially a strong strong long-term opportunity unlike someone i know no i'm not gonna throw it because i really hope that this doesn't do its thing in the near future so Anywho, so we are looking to potentially pass along another opportunity or earn another opportunity for some crypto, some passive income, and we're just going to journey and video vlog that and show it to you guys. If you want to jump in, great. If not, by all means, your prerogative, do your own research on a financial advisor, things that I'm supposed to say, stuff like that. This is my crypto journey, and if you want to be a part of it, great. If you don't, there's other content out there for you. So with that said, let's take a little bit of a dive into Kubo. Let's take a peek at what's going on, and uh, we'll go from there, shall we? Let's jump to the computer screen. So what is the Kubo protocol, you might be asking? This is another node opportunity that we have looked into, and we figured we're going to take a stab at it, because why not? It's what we're here for. We want to invest and try these things out to get a passive income, so that way we don't have to work anymore. We want to sit around and do YouTube videos and drink beer and do beer reviews for you guys all day. So let's take a dive into kubo as you can see i do have one node and we'll talk about that node here in just a moment i think this is a very good potentially long-term spoiler alert for the rest of the video a long-term opportunity at a stable coin comparison and you'll hear about that here in just a moment versus something else that we've done um which we're still in for the long term but i think this one might have more potential in the long term just because of the backing and everything that I see on the platform. So let's just go right into the nitty gritty and the paper and everything you see on screen. We're gonna talk about a couple of things, just kind of give you the introduction. Uh, we're actually gonna show the developer who doxed himself in an AMA. I'm gonna show that from another YouTuber and just give you this nice information. And then of course, we're gonna give a shout out to Crypto Wealth because he you know, gave me a lot of good information on this platform. And he's made a lot of money in the crypto space and Mind of Tron kind of want to start following in his footsteps to make bank so i know that he's got a couple of kubo nodes and he had spent a pretty penny on them 
and he's making some serious passive income. So why not emulate someone so successful? So um, first off, uh, just a quick basic, you do need to have Matic on your MetaMask. Uh, this isn't really exactly a how to get in video. If you guys wanna see how to stuff, I know I owe you a how to for Thor adding Polygon and how to for Animal Farm. And But if you know, you know, you know. So we wanna have Matic on our wallet. You can see here, MetaMask, we've got Matic, so on and so forth. And then you're going to be able to go to the quickswap.exchange where you will get your day dia whatever and your kubo which you will need for a node purchase but let's talk about it real quick what is kubo kubo is a node program that owns its liquidity and then automatically adjusts the supply in order to maintain a stable yield forever kubo maintains and grows a dia treasury that gives the token a real uh, real floor value besides this the dow contract owns the all the tokens in circulation there's no possibility of rugging so what that means in a nutshell is as there's more node purchases they have a smart contract written in there to go back and forth with the stable coin to keep the apr of the protocol and of the node at a constant value for up to a year. They have stated that there are funds for nodes up that will be able to, with the fluctuation, be able to pay out your rewards for a full year and so on and so forth. Why is that enticing? Because if we look at other projects, let's say we're going to jump into, uh, if my computer will load, we'll jump into Thor, uh, just my LP staking over on Thor, where we jumped into the protocol at, a, it's not going to show because I have to switch it over to this. So let's just switch it to this. Do we need to switch it to this? Yeah, we'll just switch it to this real quick. We're going to go back to the Avalanche Network right here. So on Thor, we have to probably refresh our screen, which is a great opportunity to take another sip of beer, because why not? All right, so looking at this screen, we uh, the main thing I want to... Looking at this screen, the main thing I want to highlight, I don't care about the results or anything like that or what we have invested in the platform, is we want to talk about this 463%, this APR. When we first jumped into this Thor AVAX Joe LP farm, the APR was at like 1300, 1400, 1500. It was insane. So I wanted to jump into that and go. But ever since the platform comes out the more people that are putting into this farm the lower apr is going to go because of the staking amount that i have i haven't put any more than my initial whatever uh has gone down so the apr is going down what kubo is trying to target and to incentivize is that that apr will be consistent while you produce and own one of these nodes the reason why i like the sound of that is because with thor and you want to keep that higher apr you have to keep adding in compounding building and growing whereas with kubo you can just do your initial investment you can see what your ROI is going to be and you can withdraw and keep going from there. There's no necessary need to keep adding more into the platform to keep that number up. So they want to give you that fine stability there. Um, moving on, why does it exist? Passive income. That's exactly what all these crypto platforms are pretty much going on. We're all here for passive income. I'm vlogging my journeys about passive income. Here's another outlet because you guys are going to get sick of just hearing about helium. You're going to get sick about hearing about potentially dead planet watch aware element mining unless i get an air queen oh you're gonna get tired uh i hope you guys don't get tired of block create because i'm so excited for that i'm really excited to play that game but there's only so much content i could provide why haven't i provided deeper network content is because there's really not a lot to show like I've been staking deeper now with the new helium there is but that's a different time different topic but again I can't keep that content going for like three weeks. So you guys are going to get bored. So we're going to keep looking at other avenues and other opportunities that I can just talk about and show. And this is it. So passive income. They say our team is very passionate about passive income. We set to create a passive income machine that would work by itself and didn't need any extra input. The one thing that they are highlighting twice already is that they're saying no possibility of a possible rugging. And then they wanted to create a passive income machine that works by itself. So this is all tied into a smart contract. Kubo creates yield from the scarcity of its own token mixed with mining its liquidity and maintaining a Dia treasury. How can I participate? Really simple. Make sure you've got Polygon set on your wallet. We actually got to switch this back to Polygon. So make sure you have Polygon set on your MetaMask wallet. So that way you've got Matic as your main token right there. You're going to go to quickexchange.com or a quick a quick swap dot exchange and you're going to get some uh, dia and you're going to get some kubo we'll talk about how much exactly you need here in a moment you're going to connect kubo into your kubo dao once you're on the actual app which we're going to pull back up it'll do that automatically for you and then you're going to provide x amount of kubo and x amount of dia to mint a liquidity token based on how big of a node that you want um, they're providing a stable passive income depending on how big of a node that you go into from 0.5 to 1 percent per day and the return is higher as the price of who gets higher obviously so 
I think la when I last checked, the price of Kubo was at, yep, blah, 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 blah. And the way I did this was I put Kubo here and I put this as the uh, I, because Dia is a stable coin pegged at a dollar. If we want to get one Kubo, that's going to be 16.9 Dia. And that's about the price that I entered in as well. So run Kubo right now is about $17. And that could potentially go up more as this platform goes live and gets more notoriety. Um, and then down here, Kubo is developed by at tiny cap. And then these are their two marketing project dudes. These are our Twitter handles on top of that, looking at the main developer, we're going to pull all this right over. There was an AMA done by another YouTuber called James Pelton, which by the way, since I'm calling you out and I'm like giving you a shout out, James Pelton, I see that you have a short at Disney world, dude, if you're a Florida local, like let's talk about beer or something. Anyway, he did this AMA. And if you guys want to check it out, um, I can link it in the description of this video, but right off the bat, we just went to two minutes and 53 seconds for the introduction of Bruno, who is the developer of the Kubo protocol and he has doxed himself. So just take a listen while I have a sip of beer. Sure. Sure. Uh, yeah, so my name is Bruno. Um, I'm a software developer. I've been software developer for about eight years. Um, and I've always worked in uh, web development, both front end and back end. Cool. That's enough of that. You guys can go and watch this on your own time if you want as well. And then they also have protocols where you can go ahead and read about anti-rug measures. Basically, the Kubo DAO contract runs everything. There's nothing that the developers and the team has so that they we, they just sell off and pull. The only thing that I will point is note that each team member was awarded 10 giga nodes. So we are going to take a look at those here in just a second and how much those are. Let's go to type of nodes. I, spoiler alert, going to get right into it. I have a Plank Kubo. Uh, which requires 25 Kubo and 25 Dia, pays out 0.1 Kubo a day, and you're looking at a 0.2% ROI per day. So 2% one Kubo, let's just do a quick math on that one, 25 divided by 0.1. It's gonna take me 250 days to ROI on my Kubo at current price. How much is that you say? Let's go back to here. We need 25 Kubo and we need 25 Dia. So that's about $450 for the cheapest node that they have. And they have nodes ranging all the way up to the Giga node, which they said all the developers got 10 Giga nodes, 5,000 Kubo with a 5,000 Dia. So let's see how much that would be if we did something like that, 5,000. So that would be 78, that'd be $83,000 to get that. So they got all the developers, I mean, at current price, I'm sure when the Kubo was like a lot cheaper, it made sense, but now that's quite, quite the hefty node to own right there. And that pays you out 100 Kubo a day, 100 Kubo a day, you're looking at $1,692, so that's some serious bank right there. Um, but like I said, we have a Plank Kubo, and it's real simple. So we pull up the app up top of the main screen. It'll be launch the app. This is what the app looks like. Number of nodes, your Kubo node right here. I've got one Plank. It's getting 0.1 Kubo a day. And what happens is this 0.1 Kubo a day is paid out at midnight, I think, on GMT time for myself. So it's not like a situation where like Thor and stuff where they pay it out incrementally. I can't pull it up because I'm not going to switch my wallet back. It just pays out every 24 hours. And then they have quick links and everything here for the Kubo and quick swap dia and quick swap you can get a free you have a chance to get a free nano node if you uh tweet and they do what are they we give away one node per week to accounts that tweet about us of course i tweeted and then their documents are over here and then if you want to get started this took me a little bit to go um once you get started you you purchase your node once you have the right kubo and dia right here at mint a liquidity node you have to approve the contract twice there first you're going to approve it for kubo you're going to wait about a minute or so, and then you're going to approve it for Dia, and then it's going to go into the option of what, um, what node that you want to purchase. Right now, it's a very, 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 very small project. This token could actually explode, just like how we've seen other tokens explode on these. Total numbers and nodes are only 1,500. Current node rewards are up to 100 Kubo per node per day. Protocol locked liquidity is coming soon. Dia treasury value is coming soon. And Kubo in rewards pool, 1.8 million Kubo. So that's currently sitting at 1, 8, eh, 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 times 16.94 equals 30 million currently sitting, 30.5 million currently sitting in the Kubo reward pool. So that's pretty solid. Uh, but I wanted to go back to this, get a free nano. So I did tweet, I have a chance to get into their weekly giveaway for a free nano. And what would a nano do for me? Ooh, ooh, right there. So if I win because of my tweet, I could potentially get a nano, which pay, pays one Kubo a day. So fingers crossed, let's hopefully get that. 
Anywho, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns, please feel free to reach out to me on Discord or Twitter. Links for all that and the information is in the description of this video. Remember to always do your own research on things like this, as this is my crypto journey, and I'm just here to talk about it. Other than that, like, comment, subscribe, turn on that bell notification. Let's get to 25,000 subscribers. Go to the description and see about buying yourself a Let's Go Bitcoin t-shirt if you want. I do have other apparel on there as well. Soon to be coming, the Nerdy Dude Squad Block Create Team shirts or polos based on what you guys want. I might actually have a competition if we win those free blocks. And we'll announce this in another video dedicated to Block Create about... Um, I might host a Nerdy Dude Squad logo designing competition and the winner gets a free block on me. So stay tuned for that. But anywho, I'm a prize. We'll see you guys next time.